Okay, now player controls. Uh, here you can select and set specific video control options that will be available to all your viewers. Okay, so this is what basically the viewer, the user will see displayed in your uh, player. Okay, once they click, once they see your videos. Okay, so in this case, you can actually control the visibility of the controls like you can display on hover or always display. Okay, and in this case, I will walk you through all of them uh, very fast, okay? So, for example, you can decide to select or deselect the play bar, okay? Uh, you can uh, select, deselect your volume controls, and these are not going to be shown up here, okay? You can also share and embed okay these are basically uh, you can give your videos maximum exposure and uh, virality with the social sharing buttons okay so these are the social sharing buttons pretty much so the play speed uh, this is like the control uh, to control the speed of your of your videos the full screen if you want to um, allow I mean add or remove the full screen mode okay rewind button this is gonna play your video back 10 seconds earlier the video resolution this is really nice because it's going to actually once the video is uploaded the video will be converted into several different video formats okay so let's say that your video is one resolution uh, most of you will convert the same video into different resolutions like for example 240 360 480 720 1080p okay and this is all done like I said, using our very special transcoding technology, so the video gets rendered into the system, and from there, the video gets converted into several different formats and resolution, okay, which I think is pretty nice, and it's all done by this very special technology that we custom built inside Motivio, okay, no one has this, okay, it's completely built from scratch. The entire platform is completely built from scratch, guys, also the player is completely brand new and completely original, okay, so this one, if you see selected is going to allow the user to select the resolution which i think it's really nice and um Honestly, guys, you should leave, you know, some of this as default, like, for example, the volume, uh, the uh, the play bar, and at least the video resolution, okay? I would I would actually do uh, these three, okay? And also the full screen and the uh, maybe the picture in picture mode, okay? And I will walk you through this in a second. So the playback resume, it's fantastic because if you accidentally close the video, the video will automatically resume where you left it off okay and i think it's very very nice the theater mode gives you good uh, player view of the entire page okay it helps you it also helps you focus on the video when watching online contents okay other stuff so the theater mode uh, this one it's actually oh like i said i just told you the pick to pick mode uh, this one it's actually allows you to watch videos in a floating window so you can keep on uh, you can keep an eye on what you're watching while interacting with other sites or apps okay so let's say for example you're watching here this video and you want to uh, you know search for something else in google you can uh, select the picture in um, picture mode and you will see the video right here okay in a floating window the subtitles it's actually okay the vr 360 it's for the vr 360 mode okay in case you have the glasses you can you can watch that uh in uh, in vr mode and subtitles this one is if you want to add subtitles to your videos okay so we have a ton of different options here that you can set for your videos okay and i think it's very very nice okay now let's move on into the calls to action